Hello, everyone, and welcome to Wednesday. I just finished the second Subnautica stream. Game is fun. Uh, game is fun. Game is very interesting. Um, I don't want to talk too much about it because I don't want to spoil anything, but it's, it, it, it's very interesting. And one of the things that I have loved is that these streams are just long enough to experience what feels like some pretty, like, substantial, reasonable advancement. And that's very cool. So at the beginning of the first stream, we're just kind of, like, floundering around and trying to, like, figure out exactly how to play. And then by the end, we had quite a lot taken care of. And, uh... At the beginning of this stream, it was like, okay, well, I, I think we can build this thing, and it'll help us. And then by the end, we, we've been, like, zooming around and, like, collecting all sorts of stuff, and things have been going really well. So every stream, you know, that three-hour time period is just enough to really make kind of another, like, leap forward in, in progress. And we found a lot of cool stuff today, so it's been, it's been very fun. I, the only downside is that I only play it once a week. <laughs> That's the only downside. Um, I do. I do wish that I could play it more than that. But that's also how I felt how I felt about Metroid. You know, it's like I'm playing. I'm like, oh, I wish I could play more. But there's too many other things to do because uh, I still have you know vlogs to work on, um, especially like Japan. And there's not enough time to realistically put in another <laughs> stream day right now. That would be a bad a bad decision. But. I do look forward to Subnautica every week. This is very fun, and I'm I'm curious to see where it goes. It's also it's very different than Metroid in the sense that like, you know, Metroid, you're always making, you're always like doing like the next thing, the next objective. There's a little wandering around, but for the most part, like Subnautica is very chill. Like it's a very different experience. There's some scary stuff in it because the ocean is full of fish. Some fish are large. That's bad. That's bad. That's bad. I should have known better. 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 There's a big something over here. Evasive maneuver! But it, it's a very different vibe than, than Metroid. And it's kind of a... It's kind of a fun departure from what we've been doing for the past few months. Because we've been playing Metroid for a while. So to move into something like this, it's a very different feel. But uh, it's been fun. Looking forward to seeing what happens next week. You happy? You happy? You get to lay on two people. Of course you're happy. <laughs> Mal and I have been, um, we were watching something for a bit and then we started chatting and uh, we haven't really sat like this in a long time, but it was a little chilly and we were both under the blanket and it wasn't too much longer after that that Kep came up and jumped. It was like the world's biggest lap. Yeah, he's been kind of like, for a little bit he was 90 degrees. Yeah. And then he was like flipped that way and now he's back this way. Yeah, and he, he was just like completely asleep for a long time. He's finally awake again. Now that he's awake... I touched him just a little bit, and he just started burning. He was so happy. Yeah. Good boy. You happy boy. Of course. Well, of course. <laughs> He's very sweet. Um, did manage... To, oh, I have this here. Makes my life easier. Did manage to watch um, a little bit of the BMX today. Yeah. Uh, not a whole lot, but a little bit. Woman's all around us tomorrow. Yeah? Mm-hmm. Have you kept up with all of the gymnastics? Uh, I wanted to watch men's, but I haven't yet. But I've kept up with women's. Okay, so you're caught up on that. Mm-hmm. Okay. Well, I don't, I don't think that I'm going to be, like, all caught up on... BMX and skateboarding. Those are the two that I'm really interested in uh, for the Olympics. Um, but I'm, I'm watching it here and there. But the thing is, we're, 
at dinner, like Mal and I are watching The Pretender because that's the show that we're working through right now because we're in season two of that. So we're not watching the Olympics then, but we only have access to the Olympic stuff for a month, right? Is mm-hmm. that? I believe it's only up for two weeks though, like on demand. Really? Yeah, like two weeks after. There must be really weird licensing rights. Yeah, there are. Huh. Interesting. Yeah, I, uh, it, if, if I, I'm not, I'm not such a big fan of the Olympics that like, if I miss stuff, I'm like devastated, but if it's on and we, I mean, it's something we're paying for, at least for this month, um, I'm like, okay, well, I want to try and view some of it, um. I, uh, I, I, like I was saying, I watched um, the BMX qualifiers earlier. And there were some really good participants. So that was, that was fun. How are you doing? I think he saw a reflection of the phone, like, on the wall. Oh, he's just staring. yeah. He is a cat. And that will happen. God, he's cute. He's very, very cute. Um, we did schedule a vet appointment for him. Yeah. In August. So that worked. Yeah. I gotta tell you, I have been very happy with how Kep has been doing, but I do have just that nervous feeling about having to take him in again. And I know that it it it's a necessity because we have to check his values. But I also know that like it's just stressful for him, yeah. and I I hate having to put him through stress, but it's lesser of two evils, and we we do have to check his values and make sure that things are going okay. From an outside perspective, it certainly seems like things have been okay though. I mean, he's been acting about as normal as he could have ever acted, but he does obviously get a lot of medications every day, so. There's a lot of things that we got to do for him. I'm curious to see how everything is going, but we will find out next month. We'll find out next month, buddy. We're taking care of you. We're doing our best. Okay. I'm going to end it there. Thank you so much for watching. And as always, let's meet back tomorrow, shall we?